I am sure everybody, it is me Alice and today I'm going to test the new Revolution Fast Base Stick Concealer. It is mine, I have mine in F1 because I am like really pale but basically the foundation is, is like a stick and it, like a new concealer which I have used a lot and this is £4 and a high coverage and then this is £5 so I'm hoping the coverage will be really good. Let's go on the video! Primer because literally this acts as a glue for your foundation, so I recommend this. So I'm gonna put this like on my T zone, just everywhere on my face, really, like especially like oh like on my nose because I usually get really oily on like on my nose, and usually you have to like re powder. So this won't be oily when I have my foundation on. But yeah, it's gonna put this all over my face, and like literally my, my skin is awful like at the moment. So hopefully the foundation will cover all of. Of my spot, so hoping it does anyway. So after yeah. I have primed my face, I'm going to use the foundation. I, like I, literally, it is a stick, and like to blend it out, or to blend it in my face, I'm going to use the buffing brush, just because I love to use this for foundation. And it's, and it's amazing. So I'm just going to kind of like draw it on my face, I guess. I'm not really sure how to do it, but I'm just going to kind of like draw it and hope like it slides on my face perfectly. And also, I'm using this mirror as well. I am shook. This is the most creamiest concealer I have ever used. It just glides on your face like a dream. It is incredible. I am in love already. I haven't even blended it onto my face yet. I am absolutely amazed. It just slides on so perfectly. I think it will be easy to blend just because it is gliding on perfectly. So I think it will be pretty perfect. I'm just going to put it on my forehead as well. Literally, <laughs> this is amazing the thing is like i hate is that, that like it, it can kind of like it can go really weird on here like as you can tell the foundation is kind of cut off a bit but it'll be all right i'm guessing yeah. out, like like i would with what the foundations like, this is a perfect match because i am really pale and literally like, like they're all sold out in like most of the other shades and literally i found it like on another stand in superdrug um but yeah, it's really good and actually it's really blendable. I feel like the coverage is like medium, like it isn't really heavy but isn't really light. It's like in the middle which like is perfect, it's perfect as well. So I would recommend this foundation to everybody because it's just blendable and glides on your face so perfectly. Because yeah. literally the coverage is amazing and it's only £4 as well. Like literally and it's the perfect match as well. So hoping that the foundation and the concealer will work together perfectly because I'm hoping they do because £5 and £4 for both of them is amazing so I'm just gonna like put it under my eyes and just like on my chin and basically anywhere where I have like breakouts because my skin's been really bad at the moment I don't really know why well I mean it is Easter today so eating too much chocolate as well but yeah I'm just gonna blend and put this on my face because it is a lovely concealer yeah. with my collection of powder it's amazing it's only two pounds and honestly this is perfect like and this brush is the real techniques one and I love it so much I'm um, honestly like the foundation like after I powdered it'll stay like on like literally so good it's like a dream come true this foundation and honestly you would recommend it to anybody like literally you'll be like oh my god I know this foundation is amazing you've told me like 500 times however it is the truth and literally it's just so good like I also have to look in the mirror for this like after I have powdered my face looks flawless I'm not even joking I've got no words is so good i recommend this and you're all gonna be like yes i know i've heard you to soup drug you need to look on the revolution stand even though they'll be sold out like everywhere because literally every time I went, like every like literally every time i, I went to soup drug on the revolution stand the foundation and the concert sold out but honestly you need to get it because it's really good I recommend it. So yeah. first, I'm going to use the best bronzer ever for pale skin. So if you are really pale, you need to get the Maybelline the Master Sculpt because it comes with a little highlight and it comes with the bronzer. And honestly, the bronzer is like perfect because usually like blood bronzers in the past I've used, they've either been really orange or they've not blended. But this one is very nice for pale skin and super blendable. And the brush I'm going to use is the sculpting brush just because it is perfect for this bronzer. And I'm just going to put this like on, on my cheekbones. 
Honestly, look at that already. So after I have bronzed my face, use the Moonchild highlight palette just because it's so pretty and it's got a lot of shades in it. So I think the shade I'm going to use is this one and this one just because they work perfectly together. And I'm just going to use the highlight brush, which is perfect. And this is honestly it's really pigmented. I am hoping that it won't take off foundation because like, you know, because it's just going to be a test. And I'm not even joking. The foundation brings up the highlight so much more than all the other like foundations. Like I am honestly being serious here. Look at this. Look at oh, hashtag obsessed too much. I have to repurpose it like 500 times. However, it is worth the calories. So you know, it'll be all good. I cannot hype this foundation enough. Literally five pounds from Superdrug it is a bargain. For the quality like of a drugstore foundation literally this is amazing and the per they've got lots they've got, i think they've got like 18 shades or something or 12 honestly it can be for every skin tone it honestly glides on perfectly like a dream as you've seen in the video if you enjoyed this video if you did make sure to leave a thumbs up and then comment down below and i'll see you in the next video bye <laughs>